My name is Kath Weir. I'm a research associate at the Biomotion Lab here at Stanford. We are interested in learning about how walking patterns change with um, different conditions, either age, disease, which would be osteoarthritis, um, ACL, tears and reconstruction. Um, we're specifically interested in the knee. That's our main, lab's main focus. And we want to know the relationship between forces in that joint and how the joint changes or whether it's healthy or not. We have two sets of cameras. One uses the traditional um, marker-based system which looks at reflective balls placed on the body. These markers um, have like a 3M light reflective tape on the outside of them. And so with uh, um, our cameras, which have an LED uh, ring light around them, it will uh, flash out, uh, reflect off of this, get right back in the camera sensor, and then um, we can calculate the 3D position of each of these markers on, on the body um, in, in our laboratory space. The other system uses what we call markerless technology, which uses eight simple video cameras in order to recreate a person in space. Essentially, we have eight pictures of the person around the, the room. We then project those all together um, to create a volume that the person occupies in space. We then create a model from our laser scanner, and then we fit that model to the person. And so using that technology, we can look at how the person moves through space based on their um, visual hull and the, how the model fits that visual hull. So when we create a subject-specific model, um, we can then more easily track the space that a person occupies when they're walking through our lab, um, and this makes the math a lot easier. Our lab's main focus is understanding knee osteoarthritis. Osteoarthritis is probably the biggest knee disorder. Um, it affects 10% of the world population, I believe. It affects whether you can um, get on and off a bus, whether you can walk up the stairs, pick up your grandchildren, um, and it leads to depression and a whole other host of other things.